What's good everybody? Welcome back to another video. It's one of the most anticipated videos that I've had because, well, you know, I'm streaming, doing YouTube, everything like that. Everybody wants to see that new setup. I've had it for a couple of months now. I just never really got around to like make a video out of it and stuff like that. So this is why we're here. Showing you my new beautiful setup. I made a video about it, my new office. Now we're gonna go into detail and I will show you exactly what is what, what I'm using, stuff like that. I've got a couple of things that have already been pointed out in the office videos. Cable management. It's okay, okay? Please don't kill me for that. The cable management is okay, considering that it's so open space and stuff like that. You could do better. I actually am 100% serious. You could definitely do better than that, but it's okay. It works. The poster in the background, right there, this one is actually self-made. It is made in Source Filmmaker, which is like a program on Steam. The model is just like sat there, then put into Photoshop and some ridiculous resolution. I've sent it to like Poster X, whatever the hell website in Germany, and it was around $100 to get it confirmed and to get it done. And why do I have one, two, three, four? Why do I even have four setups? Uh, Quick and easy answer is that I've got sent a little bit too much when it comes to graphic cards, monitors and stuff like that. So I figured instead of wasting it, I'm going to create a little lounge center, which means that if there's a YouTuber, I wanted to do it with Jeff, uh, if there's a YouTuber, oh, let me go down like this, hmm. doesn't really work. If there's a YouTuber or something that want to come over, we can stream together, we can do a LAN together. I've technically got place for four people because the laptop that I have, that Predator thing, is one hell of a beast as well. Run CSGO and everything like that perfectly. So let's get into the setup for you. And another short disclaimer. All of the products that are in the background from Acer Predator are sponsored, which means technically I'm not paid to show them, but I got them sponsored while I was in a partnership with them. The same thing goes for the Xtrify things. I got them sent for free. And the same thing goes with the G Fuel things. I got these sent obviously for free as well, since I was in a partnership with them as well. First, what is really cool is that you have the kitchen. This is the kitchen. And this is the actual office. So it's a very open space. In the summer, it's not really that hot. And in the winter times, it's not really too cold. It's just a perfect setting for an actual office, which is why I chose this room to do that. We will start off with the big boy. A Maxnomic chair. It's an old one from the ESL. In the background, you have the poster that I've already said. The setup right here. This is a signed poster from NIP from Oakland, where they actually won the tournament. A clock. On the top is white paper, which you can draw down, and you could technically use that for photos. Then you got one webcam, two webcams. This is the Logitech C920s, C930s, and the smaller C270s, I think. All of these four webcams show different angles for the stream. The main setup, which looks like this from my perspective, is the Acer Predator 100. 44 hertz monitors. One, two, three. As a main webcam, I'm using the Logitech Bryo on a little Predator thing. It's supposed to be for the G1 for the other PC, but I feel like it's a really cool holder for the webcam. I got a really, really big mouse mat, the Fury from HyperX, below everything. I really like that. I'm very uncomfortable with having like that desk because I'm playing like this. So I like to have a mouse mat below the actual one that I'm using. Now you can tell the NIP mouse mat is right there with an Xtrify Heaton M2. Very nice mouse. I've been using it now for like four or five months. Never had any problem whatsoever with it. Very, very good job by them. Not gonna lie, it's very good. Then you have the Xtrify keyboard in different colors. It's nice as well, very good. 
the Shure SM7B as a microphone with a microphone arm from Rode, right there. Rode, nice stuff. You have the voice tone, the T1, as well as the Alphead 8 mixer. Everything is going down into that microphone, coming down here to my PC. I'm gonna link you all the details in the description. This is my main PC, it has two 1080 Ti's in it. Before you're actually gonna rant about how old you'll need it for seeds go, technically, yes, but it's also like for videos and stuff like that. The power that this PC has is literally blowing stuff up when it comes to render times and everything like that. It has 64 gigs of RAM, a really, really hardcore CPU. The case looks very solid from NZX. T and there we have a little other case. I'm not telling sure. you I can't I can't really put that aside for you But in there we stored all my external hard drives in there There's like 15 hard drives in this for every kind of footage for every kind of other thing stuff like that For my main setup as well for streaming. I have a little LED lamp Which is like pulling the light down there you can turn it on and then you have perfect lightning for the Logitech Brio because that 4k camera does need proper lightning actually. If you go over here, you have the extra fine mouse bungee as well. Very nice with a couple of USB hubs in the background where you can plug additional stuff in. A printer, it's probably not gonna be that interesting for you. Oh, I'm looking forward to using that one time again. My Ronin. Okay, this is the main PC setup. All the details will be down below in the description if you're interested actually, because otherwise I'm gonna sit here 10 minutes talking to you about what exactly is in there. Over the other setups, I'm going just a little bit. Maxnomic was so kind to me, he just sent me one and two new ESL chairs. The Acer Predator G1 with a 980 Ti in it. The standard thing, I'm gonna link you that below in the description as well. Look at that small, like, just look at that small PC compared to a 24 inch monitor. These are my old monitors from ISO. They're going to get replaced kind of very soon. Extrify again came through with the mouse mats and the mice. Hey, that looks pretty cool. <laughs> Not gonna lie. You have there another M2 from Heaton with a Fury below. I really like that setup, that combination. So I keep using it, keep using it. Above, you have the first ever graphic card box that I got sent, which is, or which was, I think the 980 Ti. A couple of GFuel things, an Nvidia dock over the top. You got the gunner glasses that I used to use, plus that's actually sun, that's actually sunglasses from Extrify as well. I'm using those. The trophies, my 100k plug and my men's physique things in case people are always wondering. They have a little penguin. One, two, three lamps. They're looking really cool in the dark. I might get a shot in the end of this video when it comes to them in the dark. The nip jerseys, a couple of CSGO knives. And this is pretty much the same setup as on the right side, just with one of the old and knit AK Racing chairs when they were sponsored by AK Racing, which is like two years ago or something. Again, the x keyboard, the x mouse mat, below that the HyperX Fury and the HyperX Stinger headset. The ISO 120Hz monitors with the turbo mode, which are like oh, three years old already as well. And my old PC. I think my old PC still has an 80 Ti in it. See, the cable management, the cable management is not all too shabby, I'd say. It's not all too bad, as well as in here. It's not too bad. This is my setup in the entirety. It is, whew. I do like to believe I got everything from my setup for you. I think so. But this is my setup in its entirety, from main PC to two PCs that people can use if they come over, do a LAN or whatever. A laptop, which I'm usually taking to events. Oh yeah, totally forget about that. one. Two. Extra 5 was so kind to send me a mouse mat. You can see right there. The XTP1 NIP edition, as well as another M2. The M2, as well as the Extra 5 NIP edition, will both be given away with a skin. The link is in the description. I really hope you enjoyed this setup video. I don't. I hope I didn't forget anything, any kind of piece of hardware that I use that I showed you in this video. If you got questions about them, just hit me up on the chat on the stream, they're most likely going to help you. I feel very comfortable using this setup, so yeah. There will be a new video as well very soon where I'm going to talk about the 240 hertz monitors that I have here. And they 
they're going to replace this beauty and this beauty. These two are coming on the left, on the right. We're gonna see each other at East Salon Cologne. Setup video is done. I hope that I didn't miss anything. And um, yeah, hope you enjoyed it, everybody. If you got questions, do not hesitate to post them. I'm gonna try my best to get them answered. Anything else? Not really. Have a good one. Peace.